Morning. Hey there. Hmm. Holding up okay? Just... Guess the uh, pup is still around, huh? Looks like it. Hey, Sif. <clears throat> Hello. I got something for it. I'll see if it's... If it'll allow me to do this while it's distracted. <laughs> no, there's no way. I, I'd have, I have to... There you go. <laughs> Good morning. Let's put that anti-bionic cell on you. That way... The fuck is a get rid of all that optic. Mage. Time for the morning jog. Good question. Good question, Shriek. It helps with mange. Anti-bionic? I don't think we've understood what bionics are yet, so... Anti-mange. Yes, it's it's an anti-mange. <clears throat> Bruh. <sighs> now is a good time to blow my nose that's been bugging me.
Well, well, well. Look who it is. No, I'm just getting like a hardcore uh, vision stuttering, so I rejoin the world. All right. <laughs> I see that doesn't fix it. I didn't read it anywhere. Hmm. We're here to pick up anchor, and apparently we're only allowed to speak to Sazim about it. Is that what you said? <laughs> Great. Ah, well then we wait. I just call it catch. <laughs> Grape is muted. <clears throat> I can hear you. I could mute you if you want. Interesting taste. If you need me, I'll be right fucking back. <sighs> Thank you, Ketch. Why is she wearing that? But the good bomb couldn't find her shirt. I'm sorry. So she chose to wear a whore outfit? Kyler, as you stand here and observe the I don't know what forge that you've worked at for so long now, you see the dog holding one of your favorite pair of tongs in its mouth. Almost a slight wag in its tail. Good morning, How the hell do they lose an anchor? Come on. I mean, technically, it should still be where he's standing. The dog doesn't seem That's quite content with coming closer. It's okay. Unless someone else can lift the damn thing. Ta. Okay. <clears throat> no, no. <sighs> Starts to run off. <sighs> uh, it's a thief dog. Goodbye. <sighs> Ladies, oh yeah, you come join yeah. us in a jog. <sighs> can I please have that back? <laughs> <sighs> Catch, please. There is a chieftain. Catch. Oh, it's too early for this. Think of it this way. No, what the? Excuse me. Catch, please. Ah. Uh. Uh, 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 you listen, Bjorning, maybe? Woof. Woof? Does woof work? Uh, what's, sto what's stop in wolf language? Oh, God. Uh, 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 ah. <clears throat> Backing yourself into a corner, catch. You are nimble. <laughs> All right, end of the line, buddy. You gotta hand it over. Please? Uh... When the final utter of the word please, the natural 20, Kyler, the dog will slowly approach as you approach as well, and hand it off. <sighs> well, you've successfully woken me up at least. I 
had a pup just like you once. Different, but similar. Maybe we should get you like a collar or something. Wish I knew how to speak to you. <clears throat> All right, come on, let's get back to the forge, okay? <sighs> At least your paws healed now. Okay, buddy. <laughs> I'll look after you, okay? If you need me to. <laughs> wise drow of the ocean, your stream cam seems to be a little awkward. You're much better at this than I am, Ketch. Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> yeah, you said that wasn't convincing. <laughs> yeah, now that you've done that, you have to do that forever now. I'm not accepting anything else. What congratulations. <laughs> All right. Okay. I know, I know. Come on, where's my servitor music? That's the one.
Enjoying the view, are we? Hmm. Indeed, I am. It's peaceful out here in the morning. I don't blame you. It's a good secluded area first thing in the morning. Also, sometimes the bar's a little too busy for my liking first thing. That's fair enough. A lot of people. Should we, uh... So I don't think enough people get... Take a walk. Get to stop and, uh... <laughs> we can. Mm, I mean... Anyone? Well done. Well, it's because I'm uh, fixing something okay. inside my head. I thought you had a, I thought you had a headache. <laughs> Let's see what can talk. Do you want to go this way or do you want to head out of town again? That way is fine. Show me all the uh, good fishing spots. Hmm? <laughs> I find, as long as you don't go all the way out to the pier, there is a good store, a lighthouse. You can get some good fish off the back side here. Mm -hmm. How was your trip yesterday? Find the people you need to find? It's a little bit more complicated than I expected. Oh really? But I'll tell you about it. <clears throat> Get up on this rock, that way we can at least see if someone is approaching us. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. As I said, it's a li it's a little bit complicated to make contacts in those si in those two cities you asked me to make contacts in, hmm. um, and don't want to get too into it. But some outside forces might cause some issues, and maybe and as much as I would hate to ask you for this, maybe a little bit more coin might help grind the wheels a little bit to make things go faster. You said the outside forces. Uh, should I be worried? Some of some of the other, you know, unreputables in the city might make it harder to make contact with the right people. But with a little bit more coin, it might be doable. I put in some of my own as well, so it's not like you're the only one losing. Hmm. How much uh, would you need? Maybe, maybe another silver twenty copper, if you have it. <clears throat> Sure. Only because I trust you to not fuck me over. We have done uh, plenty of business as... in the past. That's the other thing. Twenty uh, two silver for you. Make sure you do it right and make sure you oh. do it carefully. Hmm? If I do it just right, you might get some money back. <laughs> we'll see. Hmm. Anyway, as for what you were asking about. Up there, I do have some information that I've gleaned, that I've gleaned. Go ahead. Uh, there is this Captain Barrera. Captain Barrera. Oh no, Corporal. I'm sorry, I've, my head hurts. Fair enough. Corporal. Mm -hmm. Corporal. Uh, there, mm, there was, uh, they live mainly in the barracks and don't do a lot of troop movement with the others if they don't have to. They're an absolute bastard from what I've heard. Of course, loyal to the Capitano. Mm. They, and from the other rumors I've heard about them, they like to live... L live in extravagant ways thinking they're higher than they are hmm. and usually 
they do this by taking stuff from others to to make it happen. Hmm, I figured as much. Related to the uh, night raids, perhaps, or separate? Maybe, but he is known for doing most of the arrests in town. I see. No doubt taking things as evidence. Indeed. I wouldn't be surprised if people's coin purses are being taken when when they're getting put into the cells. <laughs> I would be surprised if they weren't. What is uh, special about him other than the fact he is an asshole and needs to be uh, dealt with? Like I said, it's just one of the people of note that I thought you might find interesting. I'll put them on my list. Please for your request. There's a uh, Sergeant Naraz as well. Also resides in the in barracks. Same kind of thing. What I've very dishonest, a violent person. Apparently, rumor has it that this one uses the free time to hurt the bathhouse girls. I see. And then doesn't pay them for their time either. Sir Raz, you said? Naraz. Naraz. N I R A Z. Their sergeant. I'll have my uh, brain cells take note of that. As for other things I know he's done, he takes part in a lot of the merchant shakedowns. This... When, it, when the protection money, quote unquote, comes right. up. This rot is deeper than I thought. Hmm. Anything else? Last person to look into. Guardsman Marco. He lives in the town. I don't know exactly which home is his. But I know he doesn't live in the barracks with the others. What's his deal? Uh, they're known. <laughs> They have gone around and claimed illegally claiming property from people when it suits them. And, of course, smuggling other things for the Capitano. Hmm. From simple coin to other goods that the Capitano might want his hands on. There's been Marco, you said. Yes. Understood. I don't know too lot about him. I've seen him here and there when the other guards call to him, but the main thing I have heard is he used, either is or used to be dating a bathhouse girl named Basil. The name rings a bell. Mm. Interesting. This Basil was close to him. If you could maybe find her, you could probably get more information on him from her. Especially if they were a thing at one point. I might have to do that. Interesting. How very corrupt. How very rotten. Ah, these well, but, uh, There's almost no corner in this, in this country that isn't corrupt in one way or another. I suppose. Well, if no one was corrupt, I wouldn't have a job, I guess. But I suppose I should be thanking them. <sighs> Is that all you have for me today? Um, as for what you asked, yes. And I will keep looking into making those contacts in the towns you asked for. Thank you, Kazimir. I appreciate it. I have a lot of work ahead of me, it seems. Let me know if you need any assistance doing what you Indeed. need to do. Hmm? If it becomes harder than it than I expect, I will return and ask for your assistance. Very good. I'll be fishing. You have happy fishing too. <clears throat> if
If you could put that in the FT spoilers, that would be really handy. Thank you. Enjoying the scenery. Mm -hmm. What you doing? Working. I've learned a few things about a few people. Mm. How are you? You were uh, not well yesterday. I hope things will get better soon, because they're not good right now. I'm sorry to hear that. Can I help at all? Hmm. I'd like to hurt something that I wouldn't feel bad about, but... It's never fun when it's forced. Do you have someone in mind? I had thought that I had a target, but it turns out the person I wanted to protect isn't even in danger. If anything, they're now an asset to me with the position they're in. Assets are it good. It will benefit both of us. Mm. <clears throat> I, uh... want to ask you something. <clears throat> to do mm. something for me. But they will preface and say there are uh, other avenues if you don't feel up to it. Or it's not your kind of thing. Or if you don't feel comfortable. I'm sure you know what my kind of thing is by now. Or else you wouldn't be asking me. Guards have been doing uh, night raids. Taking part in uh, going to Belerno and Corsetto. Stealing things, hiding them in a cache somewhere, hidden. I uh, preserve 200 silver. It's recently been taken, and they're trying to get it back. But, it's not just the Nautis guards. The Imperials are involved as well. A certain sergeant is involved. I was wondering if it was uh, possible for you to tease anything out of him. Gently, of course. They don't need to know that we're onto them. Yeah, I can. You've been there. Uh... Don't worry about that. Well, I've seen how you've acted around him. I want to make sure it's okay. It's more so how he cannot help himself. I don't want you or the others to get the wrong idea. Uh, it I is see. simply what it seems. He's being used. Some of the others would not take kindly to knowing that, so <clears throat> do keep it to yourself. His recent up in rank is a problem. But it won't be for long. If you've got a handle on it. He's a valuable, malleable asset. I agree. Very young. Not really sure how I feel about it, to be honest. There's a weird knot right here. 
Hmm. Not sure if it's from the injury or something else. Well, if you can, you know to tease out. If you don't feel up to it, you don't have to. Hmm? I hope I can get something out of it. If you are free tonight, we can pursue it. I have to see. I've just learned a lot of... I can get to him alone in the bathhouse. I already have plans there later. We don't need to, uh, you know, beat it out of him or anything. Just, you know, put on your womanly charms. I don't have any of those. Maybe you could use it as a chance to practice with uh, Miss Basil. You can handle it how you want to. I trust you. Thanks. I have some errands to run, but I'll uh, catch up with you later, yeah? Good luck. Just before I lose you, um, I just need to let you know that I need to buy a bone mending potion from you sometime in the future, whenever you have the Thank you, valued customer. Please you come again. Of course. Thank you very much. If, uh, if you excuse me, I have a client. Do watch over her for me oh, yes. if I am not around. I will. What about I have remaining? Um, thank you again for your help. From you Good morning. Good morning. Shall we? Um, probably we probably shall. Myself if you weren't there. I'm fucking turned oh, around. Going through. Good there we go. Oh. <laughs> Good it's morning, okay. Basil. <clears throat> Good morning. <clears throat> I might need something to drink when we get in. <clears throat> <laughs> Don't let I'm me stop my you. Voice today, sadly, because. <laughs> From what I've heard, you might need it. Yeah. Let me check upstairs. I know one of my girls hasn't been feeling too well, and when she comes back in, she likes to lay upstairs. So let us see. <clears throat> Gonna need that uh, copy and paste again, if possible. The room is free. So what do I owe the pleasure of having you visit me so early in the morning? Well, first of all, you're still alive, so congratulations. I was touch and go for a while. I don't know how you managed that. I was but very worried myself. You got by. Neither do I. <laughs> I'm pleased. That makes me happy. 
I don't suppose you have anything to, uh... Tell me by any chance. <sighs> Not really. I've already told you about... Small things here and there, I suppose. The list of guards that you needed of me. Mm. I need you to uh, look into that a little deeper. Focus your efforts on that for now. You, um... Um, okay. When I asked you about this... I gave you the name of a guard. Marco. Mm -hmm. You told me he was uh, a good man. Yes. So, why would a good man be illegally claiming property from the peasants of Nautis? All I know is this, uh, from what I told you about Marco, about us, he and I, we were nothing for a while. We... We spent a lot of time together, and, and then one day it was just gone in an instant. Related to anything? Yeah. <laughs> First, it just... I know Marco knows... <laughs> well, he isn't a coward. He knows when to cut his losses. But... At the same time, he is... He's so scared of the Capitano, in a way. And he owes a debt that he cannot repay. Out of everyone. I feel... I feel like he would ditch the Capitano if enough pressure was applied. He would leave all of that behind. He has to follow orders because... What else is he supposed to do? Get stuck doing shifts in places that would get him killed? He's trying to protect himself. But He's also a guard. People that he loves too. He's supposed to protect the town. That is his job, Miss Bazor. But when the Capitano threatens you and the people around you that you care about, you have no choice but to listen. That's why I don't. F I know he is a good man. I'm put in an awkward position here. He's not just doing stuff he is told to do. He is doing things for profit. Not just for the Capitano. I don't want him hurt. I told you I wouldn't hurt him. Because I trusted you on your judgment. That still stands, but I have hesitations. I know. There's also a uh, sort of a sergeant uh, in Iraz ringing any bells. He apparently frequents the bathhouse. He, um... He doesn't like to pay each time he comes in. Some days we do get a little copper here and there. The my girls here are worth almost ten silver. And he treats them like dirt. I heard he hurts them. Like we're nothing. He does. Has he ever hurt you?
Once or twice. Understood. I know my limits when it comes to pain. Sometimes if somebody's doing something to me, I don't even notice. I'll see what I can do. When it comes to Marco, there's... I don't want you to hurt him, but... Maybe letting him know. Maybe, I don't know, visiting him at his house. And... Remind him how much of a monster the Capitano really is. Or what he's been doing. You understand if... <laughs> if that goes poorly, everything I'm trying to do right now gets out into the open. If you are wrong about this. Then you can say my name. And it can be my fault that I sent him there. You can use me as a, a scapegoat something. I don't want you hurt either. I were considered. Where does he live? You can write it on that piece of paper. It's been a while since I've been to his place. Give me one moment. Mm -hmm. If you're able to come visit me again, a little later in the day, sure, I'll have the exact location for you, and I can give that to you. It's been a while since I was last there. I'll uh, think it over. But only because I trust your judgment. People don't care about us. We are here for a reason. If they go Always after you that. again, if they go after you again, run. You have to run. It doesn't matter how many times they push you down and force you, you have to get out of there. We've all been there. I think that's happened to me like three times now. You never know. I never do. Honest. Oh, no. uh, 
same time. He does this motion. Quick, Salam Zegol in front. Salam Zegol behind. Line. You do this. You he handle four Salam Zegols at the same time. That's a very interesting wow. motion you have there, Pepe. <sighs> Jeez. Oh, it seems like I got a little bit worse than that. Money. Money. Oh. Wait till I tell them. We're going inside. So? Stop right there. What are you doing with the uh, hooded mask on, huh? You're making me nervous. Well, I will get out of your way then. Yeah, how about you drop it, huh? My mask? I don't think so. Oh no, huh? What you got to hide, huh? Nothing. I am a quite a ugly individual. I tend to spare people. Oh shit, get out of my face then. How invasive. Seen a man with a, another another man with a black hood seems to be running across rooftops. Are. Been quite the while, huh? <laughs> that is my friend. How are you? Doing fine. In fact, I have some things to tell you. Oh, really? Shall we I go was for looking a... for you yesterday. I couldn't find you. Shall we go for a walk? I. You lead. How are you, darn? It's been a while. I think all is well here. Mm. Uh, been here and there. Now that Salted is here, wages are a bit better. Good. But, uh, um, now that they're also here, merchants are also in an uproar. They're, they're renegotiating deals and such. Because Salted isn't making it very favorable for them. Mm, of course not. Mm -hmm. And you know how there's been word around about uh, 
houses, residences, and uh, local businesses being hit and run, mm. robbed, and that sort. There's a reason for that. Smugglers are having a hard time. Now that sawtooth is stepping up in security. I see. They see these little places easier to hit nowadays. Yeah. Not that they're here, a lot of things are changing. Hmm. I originally thought it would be for the better, but uh, you seem to be uh, quite an influence in the town. Mm hmm. Well, that, uh, that strike made the other, my old boss, run out of town. Mm. Terrible. Mm, that's... Mm -hmm. yeah, things are changing. But yeah, just updating you on Salt Tooth and all that. I appreciate that. Technically, I'm under the employ now, but not officially a part of their company. Uh... So I'll see what I can, else I can uh, find out for you. I would appreciate that, thank you. If you hear anything about uh, any of the local guards, any, you know, dodgy dealings on the docks from them, mm. do let me know. And if you could, of course. If you hear anything from uh, Black Rock, anything interesting, just let me know. Mm -hmm. hmm? Of course. A pleasure, Darren. I'll try and seek you out. I. Next time you look for me. I'm going to be sweeping the docks. Sure. Oh, if you see a man sweeping the docks, it's probably me. I probably have info. Very good. Just for future reference. I remember that. Thank you. Here. All right. 50 copper. Get yourself something tasty. Thank you. Let me know if you need anything. You have a fine day. And you. Of course. Then why don't you carry me like a baby then, Zerubith? I don't think I could pick you up even if I wanted to. I can pick Sharik up. I could pick up Marcus. That man's fucking hefty, so that's impressive. I'm also hefty. I just mm -hmm. don't look it because of all my armor on. I just look bulky. You're shaped like a... <laughs> Say it. You're shaped like a cockroach. <laughs> what? <laughs> How the fuck am I shaped like a cockroach? You know when they die and they're on their back and they're like... Nyeh. Yes. Very good, I don't, I don't... You're getting very good at the mimicking thing. <laughs> she said, she said that she could pick you up, is that true? She's carried me before, yeah. Though that's more of like... So, are you the baby then? 
Well, it's more like you know how like sometimes you you hear about like a mother and their babies like stuck under a cart and they lift the cart up to to save the baby. It's like that kind of strength she gets it from. So like I'm like dying and she's like, but she Holy says she shit. couldn't lift me though. I don't think she cares enough about you. Well, you're Maybe you're I pretty small. You. I could probably pick you up laterally, to be honest with you. Yeah, probably. Oh, you want to fucking try? have a lot of weight training, you know? Just, I mean, you you want you will you let me try? Sure. Does it feel demeaning to you? Yeah. Demoralizing? Yeah. That fucking dude has been so creepy. The one in the blue. Then why would I do him, it? Right. Uh, he's yeah, he's around running around and. An eye out. He might stab someone. Yeah. I'll cut him in two. Look, oh, if it'll embarrass you, I'm not gonna do it. Back. I wouldn't do that to you. That's very kind of you. Sarah, let me see what you have. Unless. kind. No. What do you have? A knife. No. <laughs> What's she going to do with that? Whoa. Oh. Are you going to? Are you going to geld me? The only weapon that Sarah is afraid of. I'm... The class. I'm penis maxing. See, going back to the age, like, the laws of nature thing, it would take him so much longer for him than it would for me. See, I'm the winner there. It would only take me, a, like, a day or two. It would take him 30 years. You're going to die before we have our first centurial birthday. You are nothing. Thank God, I don't want to be invited to the birthday party. What? Fuck you. I don't like parties. Tandem that, by the way. Since we're only a few years apart, we should have a birthday together. Yeah, sure. A few years apart? Yeah. You'll have... Hmm? Yeah, he's like two years either older or younger than me. I can't remember what direction. We lose track. I mean, yeah. when you live for... She, you know, she, Difficult for you two, since bigger Morning. numbers, but simple numbers, two-digit numbers, mm. human brain, do easy. Yeah. Easy. Math. Apes together strong and all that, yeah. Yes. Number one. That's me. Number one. Mm. Yep. Oh, need to whisper sure something. thing. Whatever Desmond I'm not hearing that because it's a whisper. Yeah, no. I saw you had armor on the other day. Yeah. You need to get a big bit of leather armor. So I can help fix it. I've got my full set of plates now. Ooh. Thanks to Morden. Very nice. Yes. Very dangerous. I might up my rate. Even though no one hires me anyway. <laughs> Next time I need a... Next time I need a big, strong man in plate armor to kill a bunch of people, I'll come and get you. That's what I do best. Usually in one swing. Impressive. I mean, it's a big sword. It's going to kill someone too. Two leather straps. I just need to see it. Thanks. So you can examine it. I get you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> that was very provocative. I hope you know that. What do you mean? <laughs> see, I wonder if I could try to. Hold on. Do it, pussy. <laughs> what you got? Leather strips. Let me let me see if I could do that noise. I could do it. Oh, Prop comedy. Oh yeah. Prop comedy. Prop comedy. <laughs> do it for the bat. Get the fuck out. God damn it! When's the last time I took this thing out? <laughs> Let go. Come on, go. I believe in you. Down boy. There we go. All right. Let's see this. Now this is going to be very loud, so I expect a knock on my door. Now, let's see here. Uh huh. Yeah, that takes nice. me back to my childhood. Oh. No! 
Mine too, actually. <laughs> that is bad. Oh no. Alright, thank you. Got it. Hey, we're going to get a new challenge. Ah! Oh, there, Shriek. Do not I have a gift for oh. you. Let Catch take these. Again. Alright. Again? Excuse me? Catch stole them and ran off. I had to chase them. I see. What's this? There are three swords sitting there that he wants to use for a sharpening before I smelt down. However, this is for you. The dagger. He passes you an elven steel dagger. Holy hell. Okay. A steel elven dagger. <laughs> Where did you find this one from? The one that had it that doesn't need it anymore. Courtesy of this. He's pointing to his left shoulder, which is limp. His entire arm is limp. What the hell happened to you? Orcs happened, lad. Huh. Yeah, they're a problem. We need to deal with them. <sighs> we had a debt. We had a debt to uh, deal with with Silver Vein. And it was no small one. Thanks to that, though, we're now out of his uh, hold. Good. He no longer has us in his grasp or snare. The debt has been paid in full. Good. And then some. But I'll explain that later. However, I did encounter a bunch of orcs, which sadly the debtor in question didn't survive. That dagger he used on a poor woman over in Balerno took it from her. Ah. I had intended to return it to its sender, but the sender didn't exactly survive the orcs. I'm sorry to hear that. Morgan, you fought orcs before, right? Uh, plenty of times, <laughs> lad. More times than I'd care to count. Depends on what kind you're f talking about. What kind of orcs are we talking here? Shriek. The red ones. Severed. Do you mean the common red, or do you mean the Haloth red? Um, I know how to make steel now, Miss Bourne showed me, and, uh... So, I, uh, what we have... We got well, three I swords I can yes. practicing sharpening on. We have the DC running Good. about. There's a mix of green and red-skinned orcs, but they're not red orcs. They're just considered to be... I guess you could call them badland orcs, simple orcs. Then you have the orcs from Amurgadrod, which are far meaner, far nastier, and far more brutal. And then you have what could be considered a step up even from those, in a sense, which are the red orcs which you will find up in the north up in Haloth, all of which I have encountered during my time. The ones up in Haloth are especially brutal. Yeah, they are. Due to the north, uh, due to the Northlands, uh, I guess you could call it climate. They're constantly cold. cold. Uh, About as big as I would say. Probably a head shorter than you, maybe. Forgive me. Yeah, very barely. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> too much shorter than you. I was going to say they're about the same size. The orcs that were brought through didn't seem much taller than this. Red, white mm, marking. Those are... <clears throat> those will be reds. Elothian red orcs. One of if them spoke. Red and white. I will be from Eloth. The orcs up there are savage, but they are brutal at the same time. <sighs> they often have... I'll put it this way, lad. The orcs that we have out in the w I call them Badland Orcs, but the orcs out there, inside the walls, tend to be of a greenish and reddish hue, but they're not red orcs. They're just considered orcs. They tend Think to... <laughs> What's this? <clears throat> 20 copper for That's pizza. That's amazing. Pepperoni pizza with cheese. Think fast. 
You should have seen him. They ought to the uh, <laughs> take a... one down. He swallowed it. They tend to what using goblins is. What's the meaning? Menial labor. They would use trolls as muscle. Uh, is mostly, I guess, wargs for wolf raiding. I mean, no stolen carts yet. I mean, Koopa stole my cart, um, like, two days ago. You should kill him. <laughs> it was my personal cart. It was my personal cart, and Koopa stole oh, it yeah, from me. Oh yeah, you should fucking kill him. Do it. Where is the boy? Where is the boy? I don't know. I'm Thank about you. to smack him into next. Um, I forget how the months are around here. <laughs> me too. Don't worry. Do the. <laughs> that's yeah, I'll smack him into next, Jordas. That's that's what's going to happen. <laughs> Good day. Close your eyes. Oh my god, you scared the fucking shitty poo poo out of me. <clears throat> eyes closed. Alright, now open your mouth. Ooh. Ah. Uh... He puts a slice of pizza in your mouth. Ow! Mm. Some idiots leaving a car unattended. That bloody idiot. You can open your eyes now. What is this? It's pepperoni pizza, apparently. <laughs> Careful, you're gonna flick bits everywhere. Ow. I really like it. Mm hmm. Lottie it's made it. Squishy, but good. Mm -hmm. I usually don't like squishy. No. Maybe if I fold it. Now it's like a sandwich. <laughs> Ow. <gasps> Ooh, what if she folded the whole thing? What if she just folded? Yeah! Ow. But what if she... Where is she? At a shop. Oh, fuck, I gotta wait. I can tell her later, if I remember. What if she puts all of the stuff in the the dough when it's wet? I'm not a boko. I don't know how and that would go. Can you go meet them real quick? Like, like a... Alright. Like a, like a, um... What was it called? The meat pie. You remember the meat <clears throat> pies? Yeah, pies of meat. Yeah, like that. I could fold it like this. <clears throat> and then bake it like that. It would be like meat pie. What is this red shit? Uh, it tastes good. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> no hands. My hand was a full with pizza. Oh, look at, look at Bonnie gave me. Ooh, shiny. Elven steel. <gasps> oh, wow. It's beautiful. It really is. Dropped your cheese. It's pizza, you fuck. It's a pizza. It's a pizza? Yeah. I'm sorry. How am I supposed to? <laughs> I was supposed to context clues. So it doesn't look like a fucking pizza for me. <laughs> All right. I'm actually it's done with it. Not a fucking pizza. So. You know what? A pizza is like 60% cheese. <laughs> There's a pizza on the roof, like in in that what? book I read, Breaking w Bad. Walter. <laughs> yeah. Walter. Walter. Put your dick Put away, your dick away, away Walter. <laughs> no, I'm sick you right now, Walter. That's very nice. Thank you. 
Egon, Almost check this shit out. Elven Steel. Again. <laughs> Dark and steel. Oh, wow. actually, I think it's just iron. I don't know anymore. You can't really tell anymore. It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty... You know, getting stabbed by this, I imagine, is very painful. Because I don't know what I stab with, it screams out in pain. I, I'm sure parts of it would break off. Like, inside them. It hasn't broken yet. I've had it for years. It's very strong. Yeah. Let me off you while you were pissed. Right? What is plot armor? No. No one's repairing this dagger. Why? It will live until it dies, and once it's dead, it's gone. That's all. It's strange, but okay. Don't tell me what's strange. You're purple. That's hardly strange. It's very strange. I mean, look at everybody else, you know. We need to have a talk later. I'm free now. Don't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it right now. You want to see something cool? But it's all very important stuff. It depends. We need to have a talk later. Ah, the steel dagger. Elvin, apparently. Very nice. Yeah. That's what Morden said. Yeah. I'm surprised Wait, you're using you it. Sure? I heard that your dagger was uh, sentimental or something. It is. Now I have two daggers. See? <laughs> Wonderful. True. Hmm. I need to get more Perfect. daggers too, so I don't use this one as much. Because I actually don't want to lose this one. Well, Just I do have the raw seven. iron, I think, for it. If you want to buy the raw iron. Until I get another job, I haven't worked in three days. I could wait. Fair enough. Hashtag fun employed and, well, and be paid for it. Oh, cool. Fun employed. I need to go get my goods. I'm going to go out yeah, of the city actually. Bit. Just a bit. A fun little bit. Fun employed. Then, uh, I'll let you leave. Good luck. My home. Mm. It's not very okay. fun. That actually works for me. Uh, Sharik, I'll be. I'll find you in a bit. Yeah, sure. I gotta go drop this off. I need a good. She's stone. lying to you, you know. She's not gonna find you later. Later, you can be talking to veteran alone in his house. Uh, ew. You agreed to it. That's your problem. Yeah, I didn't think he'd be alone. Ugh. I mean, probably. So I don't know. Is he, does he have any friends? Boring and cunty. <laughs> Look, forget Vesvin. You and I can hang out instead, you know? I don't know enough really about you. You're people. kind of an enigma to me. Well, that's the problem, isn't it? I'm an enigma to everybody, but everyone's afraid to say hello, talk to me for a while. I was even speaking to, uh, what the fuck is his stupid fucking name these days? Hey, maybe um, that's why people don't want to talk to you, is because you refer to him as what the fuck is his fucking name. Well, it's not my fault you all changed fucking names between provinces. Hey, <sighs> what, what is the old man's name? Um, Tazim? <sighs> Tazim, right. And you are... Sharik. Right. There's a, I have a name See, tag. If you, I was talk If you like, open up yeah, and then you point. It's on my name tag. Yeah. Hello, my name is. I, I don't care. If I can't remember on my own, I'm just fucked anyway. Look, point is, I was talking to him at length last night, and I gave him many insights into myself. And all it took was him to have the time to do it. But no one has the time to talk except me, apparently. Oh well, yeah, you've got nothing job in to three do. Fucking days. <sighs> No, I've been I haven't been working for three days. And and usually if I'm not working, I'm not doing anything anyway. I have nothing but time. You could take up knitting. It's driving me that. Isn't it nice I'm not old. Some, some booties. I'm not that old. No, it's not an old thing. It could just be a hobby. I have booties. Yeah, but you know when it's when it gets cold, you can have some metal boots. booties. It's already cold. I'm joking. I've padded, I've padded leggings anyways for that. I'll be yeah, fine. Maybe a hat. And, and I think it's gonna get, I have a padded cap too and a helmet. Look, do you really expect to get that cold around here? No, I, I don't. In fact, when I saw snow the first time in you know where, I was fucking amazed. Oh. Well. I think I heard about that. I think I heard about you all, you know, going do, 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 all the way up there like fucking idiots because of some. Yeah, it was fucking cold. I don't know, yawning shit. I don't know. Yeah, it was fucking cold. 
You know, they have yeah, fire yeah. in the sky. Well, from what there. people told me about what you've all been up to, you're all fucking insane. You know that, right? I you're just kind of tag along shit. at this point. Crazy. You don't have to do that. You don't have to follow them anywhere. I didn't. I yeah, and, and then everyone hated you for a while. Gone. Yeah, but they got over it. Probably. Actually, Jazim's a little on the fence, but yeah. I think he's fine now. For the record, I'm not a deserter. I wasn't enlisted. Yeah, I, was I, I wasn't either, but I stayed there. Yeah, because you're a fucking fool. No offense. I don't think any of you should have stayed. And in fact, a couple of you, like uh, Tang, for example, actually agreed. He said that was a good idea. See, I'm cunning like that. Danger, whole lot of danger, certain death, I'm leaving. Easy. <clears throat> well, some things are more important than life, I suppose. If I had anything important there to stay for, I would have stayed, I assured you, but back then I was an enigma to all of you, and I still am, and that is not my fault. That's the difference between you and I, then, I guess. We had things there to stay for. Mm hmm And I remember of quite a few were quite afraid. And I tried to give them advice, but it's only so much advice you can give people who are scared for their lives. Hmm. I know a lot of people have been gone since then. A lot of people have been lost. You have my sympathies. But truthfully, all of it could have been avoided if you all had just left collectively. They couldn't have stopped you. Yeah, maybe. I would have gotten you all out of there if you asked me to. But, too late for that. Times have changed, and I'm not... I'm not one to run away anyway. I'm running in a direction towards something. I hope you all have the same ambitions, otherwise you're all lost. Dreadfully so. Morning. We all have our paths. <laughs> yes. If there was anything I could have taught you better than a blade, and I didn't teach you even that much, there are far things, far many things that are more valuable than a weapon, and that is in your mind. More valuable than instincts. I have not lived as long as I have because I've been stupid. Remember that. No frightened of everything. Because a bold man can do a whole lot more than a scared one. I suppose so. I'll keep that in mind. Hmm. You would be wise to do so. Now, as I've said to you before, if you need help with anything, you can ask me. I will help you. Just remember, while I do have a price, I can be lenient. I, not everything has to be paid in coin. If there's promise of something, I will do it. I just need something to gain. I'm afraid gain of amenities through friendship isn't really that isn't that material. Right. I need material to survive. I'll keep that in mind. Material repairs this. Good. Be seeing you. Mm-hmm. What the fuck? Hey, catch. You ran off earlier. Is this yours? Did you find this? This is amazing. Hiya. Even though it's a wolf, I still don't like it. No. I think I would. You know, title. Okay, fine. No, 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 no. Oh, 
the fuck do you lose a Bjorni? It's going. It's going. Oh no. Oh no. My money is on the cat. Hey, hey, hey. Actually, no, I think the wolf likes I know you're big and everything. Walter will fuck you up. Don't do it. Don't do it, puppy. Oh no! Catch. It's a wolf. It is absolutely going to fuck up that guy. It's a dog. It's a dog. Oh, it's a dog. It's not a wolf. <laughs> was it a hopper or a fucking hopper? Still a big dog. Walter fucked up. Probably be a bit stronger. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look what you did. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're you're bumping. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.